to say before reading the play I knew absolutely nothing about Hans Litten and I feel a little ashamed in a way because when you start researching him you realise what a tremendous character he was and the part that he played in German history although he has been disregarded by many for some considerable time. In May 1931 he committed the ultimate crime as it turned out of calling Adolf Hitler as a witness in a trial of SA men, guards, officers, in atrocities they had committed. And he pretty much showed Hitler up and embarrassed him and something that it appears Hitler never forgot because following the night of the Reichstag fire and when Hitler had become very powerful and was Chancellor and was more powerful than anybody could ever possibly have imagined, he had Hans Litten arrested and he then followed many many years of incarceration, torture, atrocities committed against him as a political prisoner. But that's, that's the basis of the story, but the real story of Mark Hayhurst's play is about his mother. Ermgard Litten and her struggle to find out where her son was and secure his release and in that she's just an incredible character because of her audacity and her ferociousness and her apparent fearlessness against the Gestapo in finding out where he was and this is what the story is about it's told through her eyes. I am lucky enough to have the opportunity to play uh, Ermgard Litten because she has an incredible story to tell and she is an incredible woman. I think the thing that comes to mind more than anything else is that she is a mother and a mother who will do anything to protect her child. Well, first of all there was a shouting at the gates and then about Ten brown shirts were herded off the lorry, still wearing their uniform. They carried out an SS gauntlet, like we did. And I expected them to disappear around the back for processing. Like we did. But the SS took out their guns. Started picking them off beneath my window. I mean, the brown shirts were trying to hide, it was awful. This went on for about two or three minutes. There were still four of them trying to hang on. You could see one of them hiding in the alcove where the kitchen is. I urge you to exercise common sense. I know you will. <laughs> Politics are out? Politics are out. Poetry. Which poet? His favourite poet is Rilke. Mm. Poetry is tricky, isn't it? Young's art. What kind? I'd better not say. He likes the degenerate artists. <laughs> <laughs> Do 